All right, this is uh, Wind Dove Scry. She's a Muscle Hill first full um, out of Cedar Dove. Jordan McKay will be going with her, and uh, she was purchased in Lexington. So she's the first one coming out. Beautiful, big, strong filly. And her caretaker, Katie McNeil. Here we got La Paz, Conway All Philly that we purchased at Lexington. I don't know if anyone know this guy here, Simon Allard. So La Paz from Lexington, Conway All Philly. Can be a little strong at time, but uh, she's starting to settle down a bit. Here we got another Conway All coming from Lexington. And uh, we get Wayne on the bike. Wayne's been a great addition to the team of large stable this winter. He's been doing a great job. So we got Wayne here with uh, Mr. Smead, Conway All Coat. New York eligible. I'm going to go with one more Rosie. She's a muscle mass filly. And she's um, from Lexington. We had uh, Simon with La Paz. She was a bit of a handful at the start. She um, just wanted to go, go, go. And she sometimes she wanted to go too fast, too quick, and roll off stride and stuff like that. And uh, we had to put the trotting hobbles on her because didn't want her to take any bad habit. And since we put the trotting hobbles on her, she's... She's been trotting good, and uh, she's uh, she's one of them that you get to say, whoa, more than go. She just likes to go. And, uh, yeah, we just, uh, she's New York eligible, so we uh, keep the hobbles on her, keep her trotting, get her ready for the New York circuit. So, so far, anyway, she's doing what she should be doing. I mean, they're all bomb proof. You can go by a water truck, you can go by the, the tractor, everything, and anything go beside them. They, they're really bomb proof. So at this point, you know, it's still early, but we got them. The pacers are pacing good, the trotters are trotting good, and they're not scared of anything. And, you know, that's kind of what we're hoping for at this time of the year. And we had uh, Wayne with Mr. Smead. Mr. Smead's a Conway All Coat that from the start it was very natural um all trot i don't remember i don't remember him making a break since the start i mean he's always trotting uh, very natural he's a little bit of up and down up front and he's got uh, a lot of action um but that's kind of the way he travels uh, his knees Got a little bit bothering him when we start training him so we turn his shoes backwards up front to kind of help him and we backed up for a couple weeks and blistered him which you know we've been blistering a little bit their knees and their hocks and working on them and you know they're all different individual but he's uh he's definitely got the you know the don't want to make a break type for new york i think it's important so he's going to be one that uh, he might not you know i don't know he's the fastest one but he's going to be safe he's all throughout so we're just going to do like everyone else keep him sound that's our goal right now in teaching so the big uh, muscle hill filly that jordan mckay had um from the start she was always beautiful big and strong uh she's got a bit of an attitude like switch her tails which, you know she's which we like to see that in the mare anyway a lot of the good mares have a bit of an attitude um She's she's been trotting good and everything else. We start training her, and you know we keep an eye on them like um, real close. Her knees were a little bit open, so we uh, we backed off a little bit. Right now she's just kind of jogging and going the other way, and um, she's one that we only stake late in the year. She's got nothing until September, and uh, our plan is to uh, get her going a little bit later in the year because she's a big heavy filly. She's uh, She's definitely strong. She's got an attitude, but uh, we're just going to have to take our time with her a little bit more. The one I had was uh, one more Rosie. 
she um, had a bad mouth at first. Her mouth was sore. We had pulled some wolf teeth out of her mouth, and she was always really sensitive with her mouth. Other than that, she was always all trot. She just loves to do her job, and uh, you know she was probably the quickest in that set. Anyway, of all of the trotters we got, she's one of the one that you know. In the trotting Philly side, I think she's the one that shows the most at this stage. But she's uh, she's definitely nice, and uh, she's New York bred. And her uh, full sister was the uh, River Time Rosie that uh, John Bax had that made nine hundred and sixty thousand. So we're definitely very excited about this Philly. Just gotta keep her sound, keep her together. But so far, she seems like uh, she's pretty solid.